सब्सक्राइब कीजिए धे आई चैनल को और बेल आइकन को दबाइए लेटेस्ट वीडियो सबसे पहले देखने के लिए As the number of coronavirus cases are increasing in India, the speeding of test is also increasing with it. There are a number of testing facilities on which the ICMR relies for detecting coronavirus in humans. On June 15, the ICMR approved one more test for coronavirus diagnosis. This new test is known as rapid antigen test. This will be used in specified settings and the kits of the same is allowed to be manufactured by only one manufacturer for now. In today's edition of our DNS, we will know about rapid antigen test. India is focusing on more number of tests as the corona cases in the country are increasing drastically day by day. So in order to increase testing, the ICMR has approved another test, rapid antigen test. This test is capable of giving results within 30 minutes. Rapid antigen test is a test on swabbed nasal samples that detect antigens that are found on or within the SARS-CoV-2 virus. It is a point of care test performed outside the conventional laboratory setting and is used to quickly obtain a diagnostic result. In India, the ICMR has allowed the use of antigen detection kits developed by a South Korean company SD Biosensor, which has a manufacturing unit in Manasa. The kit, known as Standard Q COVID-19 AG Detection Kit, comes with an inbuilt COVID antigen test device, viral extraction tube with viral lysis buffer and sterile swab for sample collection. The ICMR has conducted an independent two-site evaluation of the SD Biosensor kit at ICMR and AIMS. The test revealed that the kit had a very high ability to detect true negatives, ranging between 99.3% and 100% at the two sites. The sensitivity of the test or its ability to detect true positives ranged between 50.6% and 84% depending upon the viral load of the patient. The higher the ability to detect true negatives, the more reliable is any positive result. Each kit costs around Rs 450 and shows result within 30 minutes as opposed to RT-PCR test that takes 3 to 4 hours. The ICMR and the All India Institute of Medical Sciences has recommended antigen test in view of its high specificity while relatively low sensitivity. The RT-PCR test is the standard for the diagnosis of COVID-19. Similar to RT-PCR test, the rapid antigen test too seeks to detect the virus rather than the antibodies produced by the body. But the most significant difference between the two tests is the time difference in producing the results. When the test result of the rapid antigen test comes to be positive, it will be considered true positive and any other test will not be done. But when the test is negative, they will undergo RT-PCR test. Presently, the kit will be used in containment zones or hotspot areas. In both settings, the ICMR has prescribed the test to be performed on site under strict medical supervision and maintaining the kit temperature between 2 degree and 30 degree Celsius. In containment zones, the test can be conducted on all symptomatic influenza-like illness, whereas in asymptomatic, direct and high-risk contacts with lung disease, heart disease, etc. of a confirmed cases will be tested once between day 5 and day 10 of coming into contact. In healthcare settings, it can be used in three categories. First, in all persons presenting influenza-like symptoms in a healthcare setting and suspected of having COVID-19 infection. In the second category, in asymptomatic patients who are hospitalized or seeking hospitalization in the following high-risk groups, those chemotherapy, immunosuppressed patients including HIV-positive patients, elderly patients, etc. Third, 
in asymptomatic patients undergoing aerosol generating surgical non surgical interventions such as elective or emergency surgical procedures like neurosurgery ENT surgery dental procedures etc the approval of this new testing kit will enhance the testing capability and also the detection of patients suffering from covid-19 at a faster pace